Center, latest world news. The U.S. Supreme Court takes up a case on Monday probing the limits of presidential powers as the justices weigh whether President Barack Obama overstepped his authority with unilateral action to protect millions of people in the country illegally from deportation. The case, pitting Obama against 26 states led by Texas that filed suit to block his 2014 immigration plan, is one of the biggest of the court's current term ending in June. The court is evenly divided with four liberal justices and four conservatives following the February death of conservative Antonin Scalia. That raises the possibility of a 4-4 split that would leave and place a 2015 lower court ruling that threw out the president's executive action that bypassed the Republican-led Congress. Obama took the action after House of Representatives Republicans killed bipartisan legislation billed as the biggest overhaul of U.S. immigration laws in decades and providing a path to citizenship for illegal immigrants, that was passed by the Senate in 2013. Obama's plan was tailored to let roughly 4 million people, those who have lived illegally in the United States at least since 2010, have no criminal record and have children who are U.S. citizens or lawful permanent residents, get into a program that shields them from deportation and supplies work permits.